OK, Kalinda has two solid cylinders made of the same material. The cylinders are mathematically similar. Now that's an important point. That means that one is an enlargement of the other and it follows a certain rule. In fact, it follows the rule that in this case, because we've got to get from the length of the diameter to the other length, the lengths, or what we call the length scale factor, is equal to 3. It's gone up bigger by 3. That tells us that the area scale factor, in this case, is actually going to be 3 squared, or 3 times 3, which is 9. The area, so if we worked out the area of the tops, this area of B would be 9 times bigger than the area of the A. And by the same principle, the volume scale factor, the volume scale factor is going to be 3 cubed, and it's actually 3 times 3 times 3, which is 27. The volumes are going to get 27 times bigger. So although the lengths get 3 times bigger, in 3 dimensions, the volume is a 3 dimensional concept, it actually gets bigger by 3 by 3 by 3, or by 27 times. Now, the mass is 80 grams. So actually, if they're made of the same material, and they're solid, that actually this is going to get not 3 times heavier, it's actually going to get 27 times heavier. So the mass of cylinder B is therefore going to be 80 grams multiplied by 27. So just type that into calculator. 80 times 27 is 2160 grams or 2.16 kilograms. That's going to be the mass of cylinder B. So pop your answer in here. Go back and check you understand what I'm talking about up here. Okay, end of the video.